How you doing, Mukhaps? I'm happy. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Pride Sunday! Yay! Woo! 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 Today we got the, we got the Q&A and I'm using a tablet because I'm just cool like that. Actually, I just got it that week. I never had a tablet and I love it. First of all, my camera set up. What the, sh what the shit? Let me take that picture. Ignore the pizza on the floor there. Just, just ignore it. I've got two cameras today because I'm trying out a new camera and I just fixed the other camera with tape on top of the other camera. So you cops have sent me your questions for the Q&A. Oh, this is so good, it's so hot in here. Says the one wearing a beanie. Thank you for all the questions you gave to me and I will try to get every question. But hey, you gotta fail to... You gotta fail to... First question. Who the heck puts a fetus into a glass? No, no wait, that's not a Q&A question. What the fuck am I doing today? Holy shit! Exhorter asks, Alright, so my question is, if you are gonna play any like retro games in the future, such as Conquest Bad for Day or any of the Legend of Zelda games, I hope so. Just wondering, since I absolutely love retro games. Paw 5. Paw 5, man. <laughs> Apparently my answer to that was, I'm Harry Potter. What the fuck? Yes, since we played... Beyond Good and Evil yesterday on the stream. So for now it's just on the streams on Twitch, there's nothing gonna be on YouTube for now. I just look directly into the lamp, not blind. Have you had any other pets besides hamster? If yes, what kind? So the thing with the hamster was this was my first pet. We had it as a family and it pretty much died because we kept feeding him cake and stuff like that. Please don't call Peter, all right? Very appreciated. See, I'm giving you a thumbs up for not calling Peter. Second pet we have was a rabbit. He ran away one day because they were repairing the street and our rabbit was outside and he got afraid and he just ran off into the woods. He probably got eaten by a fox or something. After that we had many more rabbits. I'm just gonna count them. We had one. All in all we had five rabbits. They had a really really cool life, all of them. Most of them were able to stay outside most of the time. It ran pretty good but most of them died pretty horribly because like one of them got fly blown. I think that's the word for it. Uh, he had like a little wound and maggots and stuff and uh, then a little cum in there. I think it's called fly blown. Actually two of them got that because they were attacked by, I think it's called Martin. And so yeah, they got attacked by them and then they got fly blown, which is pretty bad. We brought them to the wet after that happened and he gave them some drugs so they just slept away. Yeah, the last rabbit, which was actually my rabbit, yeah, he just got attacked by Martin and like I went out the next day and he was just lying there dead. And I buried it right in the garden. So yeah, this Q&A just went in a really sad direction, didn't it? So they had the coolest life I would ever wish for a pet to have. What was the worst movie you have ever seen? Okay, there was this one movie. I was not able to watch it as, as, as its fullest. It's called Sharknado. Best movie ever. 10 out of 10. 10 out of fucking 10. How tall are you exactly? I'm 194 centimeters tall. And for all of you who are measuring with feet and inches, have fun googling it. How many people are living in the earth? In earth. I can't tell you how many people are living in Earth, like inside Earth, because that's apparently a question. On Earth, it's about seven... is it billion or million? I'm always confused by that, please tell me. Okay, I will look it up. Gosh dang it, calm down. Billion! It's billion. 7.3 billion. We got another very professional question here. A 10-foot rope ladder hangs over the side of a boat with the bottom rung on the surface of the water. The rungs are one foot apart and the tide goes up at the rate of 6 inches per hour. How long will it be until three rungs are covered? Git rigged scrub. If you could tell me that again in the metric system, I'm happy to calculate it for you. But fuck you feet and inches. That sounded wrong. Anyways. 
Find me in real life, baby. Krishi Chan, when is your birthday? My birthday is on the 29th of July and I was born in the year 1993. Second question, do you like Animu? If yes, what's your favorite Animu? I like Animus. Um, one of my favorite anime series is Death Note and one of my favorite films is Sakasuma no Patama and all of the Ghibli films. They are gorgeous. Chris asks, if you could successfully start a hat trend, what type of hat would you wear? Oh. Oh. You're asking why the fuck a pillow? Well, if you are like, hey, I, 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 got, I got the pillow hat now, imagine that. And like if you, let's imagine a person pisses you off or something, and you're like, nope, I don't have to deal with this shit, I'm just gonna go to sleep. Later noob. And basically you can just go to sleep everywhere. What would be a good Q&A question for you to answer? A good question... Gosh dang it, my other camera just ran out of battery. A good question would be, what would be a good Q&A question for you to answer? Because then I can just answer, what would be a good Q&A question for you to answer? And then I can answer to that. Of course, of course I think you know the answer now. Um, to that question I would answer, fuck you. I'm just kidding, I, I love you. See, I'm kissing your comment. Why keep a, I do keep lick... Holy shit. Why do some YouTubers wear hats or beanies? Is it to hide messy hair? Like, it's <laughs> <is> that messy. <laughs> of course, it's for the swag. Got that swag. No swag. Got that swag. No, we weren't really an uh, honest answer to this. Uh, first of all, yeah, to hide messy hair because it's just easier to wear a beanie or something instead of fixing your hair. Second is, try wearing a beanie for one week. Like, wear it at all possibilities. Just try that out and then take it off. You're instantly gonna feel naked. What is one thing you would tell your past self about starting a YouTube channel? You know now, but didn't then. Actually, I can't think of something right now because I think everything just takes its time to progress. I would just tell myself, keep going, it's gonna be great, you're gonna have awesome people coming to your channel. Will you one day take your Austrian butt to France? I can send you my butt in a package if you want, or I can fart into a box and send it over to France. One day I'm gonna go to France, it's just not on my close future countries to travel to list. I don't even know where I will be going next year, I just, I don't plan that, I just... I'm, I'm like, I'm going there! Wolf asks, this editing is great, like with the scissors to the knife. How long does it take for you to come up with ideas like that? And do you even plan them ever? Okay, specifically like the scissor to the knife thingy was something spontaneous. I was just like, hey, I'm gonna take a scissor this time and gonna transfer it over to a knife and apparently it turned out great. But no, most of the times I don't plan that stuff, I just... Do it. We all need a little Shia LaBeouf in our life. By the way, you look cute with beanies on. <coughs> Holy shit, so many questions. Alright, Badcode asks, who is your inspiration for YouTube? Also, why have you not seen the Bill and Ted movies? Tell me now. I told him that, I, I wrote him, I never heard of it before, please don't kill me. I just didn't see them, I did not even know that they existed before I had this t-shirt. Who is your inspiration? For YouTube, I take inspiration from smaller channels, I take inspiration from bigger channels like PewDiePie, I watch a lot of his videos. I'm watching a lot of Jeff lately, uh, also Robas, which is a Swedish YouTuber. I actually think inspiration is like the greatest thing about YouTube. And you don't even have to be like really big to do that. I hope I'm inspiring you in some way, I hope I'm doing that. Balkut asks, what are your YouTube plans of 2016? I generally don't plan ahead on YouTube because I think YouTube is a creative thing and you just need to pop the things out of your mind. I'm not gonna post my question again, Happy. You're just gonna have to go back to the last Q&A if you want to answer it. Hey, Happy. Glad I found your channel. Thanks to Blue for recommending your channel. Pump to be a cop. 
My question, if you could live anywhere in the world, but not in Austria, where would it be? I think Canada would actually be a great option, because you can just, you know, everyone is fucking polite. And even if you punch someone, they are probably gonna excuse for running into your fist. That would be pretty awesome. I mean, not like I would do that or something. Okay, those were the YouTube questions. I shall get over to Twitter. Apparently nobody asks on Twitter. Lonely. I am so lonely. Things I find on Twitter. And well, this was it then. Let's get rid of the tablet because I keep looking at it. So thank you cups for asking the question for this cool coinier. Cool, 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 cool. If you have any more questions, you can just go on down to the comments, use the hashtag AskCapiLine again. And if you ever do a Q&A next time, I'm gonna be sure to go back to this video and answer to that. And before we end this video, I just want to take the time again to say thank you to, to you cups for watching my videos. This is not only for like people who are now here for a few months or something like that. This is also for everyone who is new to my channel. Thank you very much for subscribing and thank you for watching my content because that is actually what counts for me. Because that you're actually watching my content, that means you are enjoying it. I hope that's the fact. I hope you're not like tied to a chair or something and something is forcing you to watch me because my videos are so awful, so... <laughs> I hope that's not the fact. If so, please write down in the comments. Hashtag plus help. Hashtag plus help. And with this, I will end the video. I hope you enjoyed this video today. Thank you very much for watching. And yeah, hit the like button down there as always. Also go to the comment section if you wanna have, a, if you have another question for the next Q&A or if you just wanna say something else. And here comes the poor five. In three, two, one. I'm also trying to grow a beard by the way, it's totally itchy right now. You can't even see it because my hair is so light. Ah, oh, that's so good. For some reason I can't grow a proper beard, so I'm just trying it out right now. Got a lot of empty spots, so yeah. Mm. Alright, bye then.